All right, start by doing a twist in your shoelace counterclockwise, and then you're going to take this loop and you're going to throw it over your other shoelace. You see this window here? We're going to pull that shoelace through. There we go. And then we're going to switch the positions. So the one that's on my left is going to go over right, and then the one that started off on the right is going to go left. And now you can see there is my overhand knot right in there. I'm going to reinforce it by doing one more turn. And then that way I have a double overhand knot. On my left side, I'm going to pull this out and I'm going to step on it with my other shoe. And then I'm going to pull it tight. There we go. And that just helps keep everything together while we're doing our bow on top. Straighten that out. I'm going to make a bite here. I'm going to put it in front and then I'm going to pick up with my index and my thumb the string on the left. And then I'm going to make a window. You see my middle finger? I'm going to make a window there. I'm going to push this string down and then I'm going to pinch between that window my thumb and my middle finger. And I'm just going to roll it through. Once I get that through, I'm going to put down my index and then I'm going to pull the other loop through. Now we have our bow, but it's kind of sloppy, right? We want to tighten that. So make sure that you're pushing down on the proper ends, and that way, as you're pulling on it, it actually tightens down. There we go. Now for the double knot, we're just going to take our bite, wrap it around, and do the same thing. Pinch through the window. There we go. Put our finger down and pull it through. To tighten it up, we just stick our pinky on one side, our thumb on the other, and pull it apart. There it is. Another option is a paralink. You just put your strings through each hole, put it down, do your overhand knot, and then that stays tight. You can just tuck your strings on the sides, and to undo it, you just grab it by the middle and wiggle it back and forth. 